lot of parents like this play yard once they get it all set up. Let me show you how that's done and then we will jump into all the details. The play yard itself is pretty much ready to go. Just remove the mattress pad and set it aside. To set up the play yard, first pull up the sides, make sure they all click, and then push the floor down in the center. Now grab the mattress and pop it in soft side up. You can secure the mattress to the bottom by pulling the snaps through the bottom of the play yard of all four corners. On to the accessories. This is the bassinet attachment. Make sure you take the mattress pad from the bottom of the play yard. This accessory clips on along the top of the play yard in eight places, and then you reinforce it with these bars before you put the mattress on top. For the changing pad attachment, grab two sets of bars that look like L's, the changing table fabric, and two connector tubes. First, you'll slide the L-shaped bars into the channels in the fabric, then connect them together. Keep in mind that the bars with the plastic hubs will need to be lined up with the openings on the bottom of the fabric. Now that you've got the changing pad ready, just attach the connector tubes and line those up with the openings on top of the play yard to connect it. This piece is the parent organizer, and it's nice and easy to attach. Insert the included hooks into the openings and attach it to the side of the play yard underneath the changing pad. And lastly, the travel dome bassinet attachment. You've got the bassinet shell and the pair of legs. Attach the legs and then pull them out to lock them into place. When you flip the travel dome over, push down on the bottom of the bassinet pad, you'll hear all four corners click into place. Pull the canopy and Velcro down, attach the dangling toys with Velcro too, and you're ready to pop the whole thing right onto the play yard. So why might you like this play yard over others? Well, it comes with a travel dome that can be used on the play yard as a bassinet or simply lifted out from the play yard and easily moved from room to room. All of these models include the dangly soft toys and a handy storage bag specifically for the travel dome. But if you upgrade to the LX, you add on a UV50 canopy to shield baby from the sun and wind. And if you upgrade to the DLX, you add on an extendable visor too. To round out the accessory lineup on the play yard, there's also a removable diaper changer attachment and integrated storage area for baby essentials. Then whenever you're ready, the whole thing converts to a full-size bassinet, and then you have a toddler play yard too. To recap, that makes it five different ways you can use this pack and play. So it must cost a fortune, right? Actually, no. <laughs> it's only around 160 to 190, depending on which model you go with. That's less expensive than most of the other popular play yard brands out there. And those don't all include all of these different accessories. When it comes to weight, the play yard itself weighs is about 18 pounds and the removable dome weighs less than eight. Playards can be beastly, but this is not the heaviest one out there by any means. The included travel bag makes it so much easier to carry when broken down, and the wheels make scooting it around when it's all set up easier too. Speaking of setup, I have tips to share. Graco has a push button fold, which means you can push the button to break it down. Sounds easy, right? It is, it really is. But here's the trick. Make sure you pull the floor up before you push the buttons on the side, and when you're putting the play yard back up, it's the opposite. Put the sides up first, and then lock the bottom in. So as long as you remember that, you'll hear all those glorious click sounds. I'll wrap up with one thing that I always ask myself when considering a new piece of baby gear. How easy is it to wash? Not too bad. The diaper changing attachment has wipe clean fabric. Just a wipey or a soap and water is fine. Don't use bleach. The pad in the travel dome is machine washable which is awesome. The pad in the play yard is not, but if you purchase sheets separately, those are. Graco's standard pack and play sheets fit well. All in all, this play yard is majorly multi-use, which means you can use it for multi-years, and price isn't bad at all. Please feel free to revisit the first part of this video on help for assembly if this is the right one for you. Hope this helps.